Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got a couple of square hue polishes. I'm going to do a gradient and stamp. I've started off with this lighter color and I think it's Tombeo and it's almost like a light pink, gray, tan, I don't know. And I'm going to do use that one and Montuno to do a gradient with. I have also got my latex already on my finger fingertips and I've topped the, the base with posh to get it to dry down. I am using a pre-dampened sponge of just a makeup wedge that I've cut in half and I'm going to apply the two colors, blending them kind of a little bit in the middle and um, that's what I'm going to do my gradient with today. I thought these two colors would look really, really nice together. I've been thinking about doing this since I did the unboxing earlier this month, or last month actually. <laughs> See, my new box is fixing to come and I haven't done anything with these, so I knew I needed to get on it. In fact, my new box could be here tomorrow. <laughs> so we are um, scrambling to use these polishes. Um, but I really, really loved this gradient. These colors blended really nice together. And I'm just going to be honest, I only did like really like one solid pass over all of them. And then off camera, I just kind of brushed over them just a smidge. But basically, it's, it's a one round on the gradient. They just did so well. They were just fantastic for this. And I really, I could have worn the gradient all by itself, but you guys know I can't leave nothing alone. So we we're going to do some stamping on it here in just a little bit. I really, really like this one. I'm excited to share it with you. Tap, tap, tap. Just tap that paint right onto the nail. Look how good. Oh, and I'm stuck together. Oopsie. So here's how I'm taking off my latex now. I just kind of grab it with the tape and um, get all off frame. But then I go around the edges and get that dried up polish and any extra latex um, up with the tape. And I'm telling you, this is just working great. I love it. I'm going to go in with my acetone or my acetone nail polish remover and my cleanup brush and do just a tad bit of cleanup. Just a little bit. I didn't do too bad because I had the latex on. But look how good that gradient turned out. I was really, really happy with it. Wait till you see what the glossy top coat does for it. Here we go. It just smooths it all out. Makes it look just smooth as glass. Love it. Whew. I'm going to be using BC04. And I'm going to use a couple of images off of here. Um, today I'll be using the Bold Gold from Maybelline Color Show and just an AliExpress Clear Stamper and my Clear Jelly Scraper. And I'm going to use this image. Um, that image actually went on most of my nails. I, I did just kind of like a beaded garland looking design. I really did like it. I thought it was nice and it wasn't going to cover up the gradient too bad. And then now I'm going to use the image right next to it. And I used that one on my thumb and my ring finger. Those were my accent nails this time. Just lining that up and plopping it on there. Tapping it down. And there we go. So now I'm going to do a little bit of cleanup with tape. I've used Bold Gold many, many times in the past. It's one of my favorite golds for stamping. And it just comes up so nice with the tape. Really, really does. I love it. It's kind of hard to find. You're not going to walk up in a store and find it anymore. I have to hunt it down on eBay and Amazon and places like that now. So now we're going to top this one off with some posh top coat. Seal this design in. I really enjoyed the doing this one and I, and I enjoyed wearing it. It was just fun, fun. we go. Got to get all of it done. I don't know if y'all saw, but Woody snuck in and did some work. I think he's going to have to sneak in again. There he is. Yep. Yay, Woody. And there it is. There is my manicure. And here is my swatch photo coming up. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about it. 
I would love to hear from you. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Thanks for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.